Alright you guys, I'm back with The Walking Dead Season 6 Episode 8 Review. Um, and this episode was an, a pretty good episode this week, it wasn't a bad episode. Uh, the episode opens up with uh, with the church falling down and basically, or the church slash tower, falling down where we got from, from on the last episode and basically what happened was um, you had Rick and you had, you know, you had Rick and the other, um, well, the other group basically taking out the walkers, and uh, yeah, because also the walkers have got in now, the wall was completely broke now, shattered. So you've got, you know, obviously uh, there's a way for the walkers to get in, um, which you know they kill a few walkers there. Then the governor to uh, Alexandra, um, basically she gets bit by walkers, so obviously she hasn't died yet in the episode bit yet or something. But like, well, when I saw she hasn't died yet, so yeah, um, so she's like laid in bed like, oh, I'm dying, and um, and then Sam, the kid, to uh, Jesse is her name, the blonde hair woman, uh, the one with blonde hair, that one of her kids. Well, he's kind of acting weird. He's kind of having like kind of weird dark thoughts in his head, and that is not good. So basically, she's like worried about him and shit. And stuff like that, and uh, then Carol tells Morgan that she didn't trust him or something. I don't, you know, because they're both in like the house together, and they, you know, because Morgan apparently doesn't want to kill. Apparently, the, the whole thing comes out where Morgan says to Carol, "Like, I don't want to kill. Um, I don't want to kill these wolves because, like, why should we kill the wolves? Because life is for living, and we all have reasons for being here or something like that." And then she's like, but we are living, we're living to survive in that. And then she's like, why do you want to save these guys and stuff like that? And then after that, uh, the doctor who is like, the doctor with glasses, the woman with glasses, uh, she's with that, she's with a wolf. So they're basically there's a wolf member and the doctor from Alexandra, they're in a room together talking. And he wants to get healed off, apparently, you know, he's got a few, like, injuries, not bites, but injuries and stuff. Um, and then, Morgan, and then the governor has been bit, like I said. Um, then Carl tells, uh, Jesse's kid, um, that, um, everything's gonna be, Rick's gonna start for now, and he says that, and then, the other, the other, the other guy says, um, well, your dad's just a killer, he always has been and always will be, and then Carl says, so is yours, it's part of what we live in, this is what's happened since the apocalypse, everybody is a killer now, and nobody is, you know, upset when anybody gets killed, it's just part of life, man, and just get on with it, really. And then, Michonne and Rick and the rest of the group cover themselves in Walker's guts, then Morgan and Carol have, have a brawl, and then the wolf attacks uh, Morgan. Morgan's like, I'm gonna join like the wolves and that, uh, you know, and the walkers and stuff. And he's like, Nah. And then the the, the uh, wolf like just hits him on the head with a stick. Then um, then at the end, the group are covered in walkers. You now they're walking out of the house because the house is like flooded with walkers. They've got into the house now. Uh, the governor. Who's probably dead now anyway? Uh, she is like shooting. She's like, "Fuck you! If I'm fucking what dying, I'm dying with shooting you guys." And stuff like that. And then at the end, Sam, the kid, goes, "Mom," and like that. So I don't know. And that was the end of the episode, really. So yeah, that was my review of Walking Dead season six, episode eight. What did you guys think of this episode? Was it a good episode or a bad episode? Um, I am gonna upload episode nine very soon, guys. Brag out.